Mash used his strength to open the door to the inside of the room. Did you know, you're talking to the doll? Causing the people in the room to be shocked. The boy holding the doll replied nonchalantly, thanking me for reminding me. Mash, equally innocent, replied with an innocent face, nothing. Are you the first year who won the gold coin? Mash was holding the door in his hand and answered innocently, yes, it was me. Then why are you aiming for the title of saint? Mash still didn't open the door, replying that I only intended to live peacefully with the old man at home. Mash answered truthfully, of course, none of the guys in this room believed it. Good, but you've lost your way. The voice of a saint. Saints are those who stand above the whole world. They are considered as servants of the Lord. You must prove yourself worthy of that title. So what are you going to do? I will restore this world to its original order. Do you know why humans are so strong? Because we know how to get rid of the weak. But look at today's society, supporting the weak and hungry for equal rights, loving each other. It's stupid. They have denied their reality. We are really just animals. Up until now, Mash couldn't say a word, probably thinking about how to torture this pervert. Of all species, the weak are always eliminated. Until they are completely gone. So the superiors like us will be at the top. Just like the laws of nature. Mash replied, got it. So what do you want? To live in comfort like me? The young man holding a wooden doll stood still for five seconds, not knowing what to say. The guys around didn't understand what Mash was saying either. What is that guy saying? Hasn't he heard anything yet? Did you just mock me? Mash replied innocently, without sarcasm or insult. Is that so? Then I will let you go, on condition that I leave the gold coin. It turned out that he wanted to rob the Mash gold coin, but had been preaching for an hour, listening to it all. Mash doesn't fit either, ha! Huh? What if it doesn't? Like stubborn, unfortunately you don't have any other choice. Suddenly a puppet flew back and kicked the Mash face. Mash dodged in time and clamped its head, turning around, suddenly the puppet changed back to human form. It's the guy who just had a fight with Mash. I thought this game should be more difficult. Right now, another puppet is holding Mash's limbs, Mash is still nothing but calm and innocent. Crack. This puppet is also good at muscle training. Continues for one crackling sound. The puppet grabbed a Mash leg and spun it like a pinwheel and threw it and broke the wall. Don't worry we won't let it go to waste. Mash sat up, calmly replied, I went wrong there, let me walk again. This one is tight too. Suddenly Mash looked down at my feet, I was stepping on something soft. Almost stomped on people, the rock player is at the foot of the Mash, didn't expect it to be so pathetic now. Hold on, I'll take this guy down to the infirmary. Are you thinking of giving up? Mash replies, no, but this is more important. Also, no matter how strong you are, you still won't be able to eat me. The other young men in the room froze for three seconds. Well then, you go first. How can he be so confident? Something must be wrong. And mine is missing a button, he looked down. I've seen it but I still can't believe it. First the puppet pulled out the coin, then the mushroom-headed guy ripped something off. Then he used it to knock the coin away, spit it out, hit the gold button and he took it back, just by sucking it towards him in midair. Unbelievable. Top-level skills. The small child in the room was also frozen, I'm sure I didn't see it wrong. The guy with the three-striped face was also surprised by this move of Mash. Almost lost the gold coin, why is this guy lying on the floor? He fainted and was taken to the infirmary first. What an unstable magic school. After being cured, the stone players woke up, gaping because they saw what the hell Mash was doing. The mushroom head answers, exercises the external oblique abdominal muscles. You being here mean you just saved me? Yes? Why? We are the enemy. Um, that's right, when we're in trouble, we should help each other. After saying that, Mash bit his own tongue and blood spurted out. My tongue. So here I go, take care. As soon as Mash left, the stone youth remained on the hospital bed, pondering Mash's saying, when in trouble we should help each other. That's silly. Go back to room 302 of Adra's house. The scene was a bit crowded, whose room the young people suddenly gathered here. The fire-type youth was mocked by the gravity-type youth, why are you in this room, and just changed your hairstyle? It's not inferior to the red-headed guy who fights back, this is my new style, I changed my hair image to make Lemon like me more. The shy young man wonders why Lance and Dot are arguing in his room. I see, that's why this guy's appearance is clearly 70 times different from mine. Including his height, 
Two milk cartons don't match. Turn on easy mode and see. 500% bet you're not interesting. Get out of this room. Damn my room, brother. I get a little stingy looking at you. I'll do anything to make handsome guys like you come down for tea with grandma. I hate vulgar people so much that I give them a ticket to childhood with their grandparents. Now I want to wipe them all off the earth and return to the mother planet, want a slot? This dog, want a triple kill? Alright, let's fight, buddy. Suddenly mash back, still haven't learned how to open the door, don't know whether to open it or open it, mash breaks another door. The blonde girl hurriedly ran from the outside in, it was dangerous. Surprised to see four brothers in the mash room. Four older brothers, alone. Counting four some or what? No one has done anything to you, young mother, and then what do you come here to do? Mash munched on the cream puffs happily, well, it's peaceful today anyway. It turned out that the gathering today was to discuss a plan to earn more coins, but some people just needed a pretty little sister. Currently, the lean family is monopolizing most of the gold coins. Also our Adra house has only one gold coin. Since this school year, the lean family started over mining the coins from other houses, they know our seniors are interning outside. They are purebred, they will punish what is unnatural. If this continues, the lean family will take the position of false gods. The Orcas are still working on the basics, which means we Adra students will stop this. The red-haired boy doesn't listen to anything, mainly looking at Lemon's beauty. What a great girl, you're so pretty, you're the number one girly and shy guy. In short, we have to get rid of the lean liars so they don't achieve their goals. Let's get started, just do it. Mash only needs to rely on strength through exercise, the mind has only muscles, to restore the lost peace, warm up the muscles. Mash was sweeping the house to clean the school's owl nest, when suddenly Lance came in, I'm here to help you. Mash indifferent, what, who borrowed? Hmm, simple enough. Maybe the lean guys are targeting you for gold coins. I will make a plan to hunt them. Looks like you worry about me a lot. I will kill you. Switch to the scene outside the forest, two young people as big as devils, also have two magic lines, rare. Hunting for Mash. Mash is obsessed with cleaning the owl's cage due to the principal's punishment. The owls thought the mash was food, so they pecked at the mushroom's head. Looks like these owls hate mushroom heads, must have offended mash something against it. Suddenly, a puddle of water appeared at the foot of the mash, rolled into the ground, the mash indifferently let it sink, no matter what. We come to collect, pay the coin here. The bald young man who looked like an alien said. You guys are definitely lean. That sharp-eyed boy, where Magia Lupus, the sixth fang and the seventh fang. A, hey, I know. No name in your association is worthy to be a saint. So now you can make a solo bet. Mash is still sinking in the water, gurgling. I can't swim. Then help me, sea shark. The bald guy turned into a shark, his arms floating and muscular. Into the water, where the mash is sinking. Time to hunt. Only lance and fangs remained on the shore. Let me tell you, in this war, there are only winners and losers. Damn it, this guy plays with toys before a fight or what? This lean family must be full of humor. Shuri Keth, the seventh fang launched a move, a giant disc flew over. His magic is just manipulating that disc. Then just use gravity to crush it. Just as he was about to launch a move, two owls got out and stood next to the seventh fang. Ho ho ho. Damn the owls, if you pick it up now, the principal will kick its motherfucker out. Not to be distracted, have to grind it now. But can't harm the owls. Hold on, do you know that there are only weak and strong people in the world? Continue casting Shuri Keth. Come on, the owls are also behind, using their bodies to support the sharp iron plate. Your wand is also really good, are you of royal blood? No way, hearing that the sun had run away from home. The royal family was famous for their gravity magic. He's so weak. But Fang number 7 knew he was protecting the owls. It's pitiful because you're just a scumbag, you know. Torturing trash like you makes me happier than being on drugs. We cannot judge ourselves without first judging others. There's always someone at the bottom. Only then will you realize your superiority. It's your very existence that proves that we're more than equal. Poor thing, but playtime is over. As soon as I defeat the royals, I'll prove I'm superior to them, now. Well that's strange, the owls are all back, they seem to understand the language people. When you don't need to come out, it's too much to report, bro. Gravelov. Crack. The plate crumbled. It was because the owls got in the way, so he pushed them aside. 
I see, he used that move to make the shovel tear through the bag of food. So he didn't play me again just now because of the owls. Don't joke with me. Large Shuri Keth. This is the strong point. Before he could finish his sentence, the plate broke, and the ninth fang fell to the ground, his mouth was bleeding, his face changed greatly. Why is the same mage two lines, but why is he stronger? Do you fight just to show that you are superior to others? I am different, I fight for my sister. A girl fanatic. What does that mean? Let me explain it to you. Selfish self-esteem like you, will never win against someone who fights for his sister like me.